Today, we're in the ever-changing city of Fort Myers, Florida, about three hours south of Orlando. This, in 1985, is where George Romero came to film Day of the Dead. Well, the opening to Day of the Dead. Keep in mind, we are in Florida, so the weather here changes like some sort of weird, twisted stepsister. But most of the filming took place on Hendry Street, right here in downtown Fort Myers. I'm not entirely sure what he is dragging, but it kind of does look like a body. It's kind of fitting for our Day of the Dead video. Yeah. Day of the Dead is George Romero's third film in the zombie series. There was Night of the Living Dead, Dawn of the Dead, and Day of the Dead. And when it was released in 1985, the critics kind of bombed it. But over the years, it became a bit of a cult classic. It's darker, believe it or not, than all of his other zombie films. This is one of the things I absolutely love about tracking down filming locations. Right now we're following the path of the chopper as it gets ready to land here in Fort Myers. It flies right past those transformers and that radio tower. And as it crosses over this building, you can see the top of it in the shot as well. And as it moves across the street, you can see those flagpoles right there in the front. And it lands just to the left of this building on the other side of that square telephone pole. Yes, I said square telephone pole, and you can see it in this long shot. Now I have no clue what this building is used for, but it does look like an airplane hangar. So much so for production, for filming, they used it as such, and the helicopter landed right over here near these palm trees in this open grass. A lot has changed since 1985. For instance, that house and those boats weren't here, but that row of trees, that row of trees, and that row of trees can be seen quite prominently. Hello! Hello! And then, they turn the camera that way. And right here in the movie, what you're looking at is a matte painting, not the actual street. I feel a little unprepared, but it's right here in front of these windows where you see the newspaper that says the dead walk. We don't have that newspaper, but we have this one that talks about Florida's killer toads. To be honest, as a Romero fan, I never thought in a million years that I'd be standing here in front of the Edison Theater and in this shot, you can see the zombie walking right across the street in front of it. Right here in downtown Fort Myers at the First National Bank, which is now a law office. This is almost the exact shot where you can see the alligator and two zombies walking out that door and down those steps. I don't make a very good zombie, but you have to wonder that because they had a massive alligator coming down the stairs, if the zombies behind it weren't maybe the animal's handlers. Who for thought? Now, obviously, that red building wasn't there back in 1985, but you can see that window, that wall, and this window right here in this shot where there's a red car parked in the street and a zombie getting ready to get into it when he hears the main character calling out hello. The camera raises up to about this shot right here where you can see zombies walking through the intersection. Not like them people. Nope, they're, they're fleshies.
One of the coolest shots of Day of the Dead happened right in the beginning from the top of that building. We tried really hard to get up there, but unsuccessful. So we tried to get on top of that building to look down the street that way for this shot. Even though we can't get up there, you can tell that that shot was right here at this intersection because of that building that's on the left. After realizing that there's nobody left, they get back inside the helicopter and they head off to the bunker, which is behind this gate. Well, the bunker was fake. The sign says no trespassing and we do not trespass, but on the other side of this, down that road, is where they built the entrance to the bunker. So they filmed here in Fort Myers and Sanibel Island, and then all of a sudden when they go underground, it's in Wampum in Pennsylvania. Now obviously for this video, we're not gonna be able to make it up to the Wampum Mines in Pennsylvania, but you can go online and see other people's videos from the past. Now it's privately owned and it is a data communication center, so you can't get in. Restriction is pretty heavy. But when we were up there in Pennsylvania a couple months ago, we did do some more videos on Dawn of the Dead and Night of the Living Dead. Links below. Wherever I come, bad luck. Just come my way. Wherever I go, hard luck. Is that it stays? Good luck never stays a day. A bad luck's always